Hello guys, so um, another episode of uh, me trying to create new riffs and new songs. Uh, today I will not get back to the previous one yet, because I didn't I didn't take the time to work around it. But as I was saying in the previous video, every time I wake up or every time I'm washing the dishes or taking a shower or in the most void and, and quiet moments the specific moments when your mind starts wandering and going places this is actually and most of the time uh, when I come up with riffs and ideas so this morning I woke up with this um, repetitive pattern and, and, and riff in mind. So I thought, let's try to work around it and try to build something from it. So here's the idea. And I, I'm not sure I'm, I'm even able to play that riff, but we'll see. Let's go. <laughs> Basically, the idea of the riff, um, it started as, well, I mean, it ended up a repetitive pattern, but it started as the music from, you know, I don't know if you, if you know about Final Fantasy video games, uh, there is this Final Fantasy VII battle theme, and it goes like... <laughs> And I had the same kind of idea in mind, you know, like... Something like that. And then it started turning in my head. But it's something really pretty simple, more simple, I would say. And uh, way more repetitive. So that's what I'm trying to achieve here. See, that's not really complicated, but that's a little bit tricky for me, at least, to pick it up to speed. So, let's try. I'm actually picking up and up down. Every time I play that note, it's an up pick. I don't know if it's help. If it helps. If it's help? What the fuck? If it helps. But anyway, it's always in important to understand what you're playing and how you're playing it uh, in order not to get confused. It's really important to have a, a perfect synchronicity between your two hands. Uh, or maybe not perfect, but as good as possible. Alright, here's how I view the thing, the whole thing, the whole riff. First sequence is gonna be like that. With the thrashy thing behind that second part 
or another chord, I don't know, maybe not this one. I mean, I could play that note. But I always play that. I always do that, you know, so... And I'm trying in my... In some of my compositions, in some of my next songs, not to use this interval because it's been used and overused in my own compositions and in music in general you always hear that and it's beautiful and I like this interval but I'm trying to find something new so yeah that was the second part the third part the third part is gonna uh, end up like the first so with thrashy stuff but the very last part the fourth uh, segment of the whole riff is not going to be the pattern that I started with. It's not going to be that, it's going to be something different. I don't know what yet, but it's going to be something different. <laughs> same old um, big power chord and, and favorite middle head interval, you know, just like... So maybe... But no, I said no. I have to do something different, so let's try something different. Did I find a chord for the second part of the riff? I don't think so. All right. Yeah, I remember. All right. Yeah, the big one. I remember. Okay. So that's not just one note, and that's not just one heavy chord, but uh, I like, I like it, I like the idea. Let me know what you think, by the way, uh, down in the comments, if you want to participate in the writing process, give me some ideas, some accessible ideas. Remember, I'm not a genius, I'm not a virtuoso, I'm just a average guitar player, so, but, um, yeah, I like it. Let's work around it. Uh, uh, hopefully I'm gonna get this riff even better and better every time I play it. So, let's go. And my fucking computer messed with me. Fuck. I'm sorry. No swearing. My bad. <sighs> let's go. something happening I guess it's been 20 minutes 
already too fucking long. I'm gonna cut cut this video into pieces. And uh, oh, I still I almost have no memory left on that one, so it's gonna be short. <laughs> something else because I'm pretty bored about my playing. I suck. I suck at guitar. <laughs> but I love it, so. Alright, I had another idea as an evolution of that riff. And uh, it was a more melodic idea, I think. So let's try that. <laughs> when you suck. <laughs> you just play the riff over and over until you get it. The second riff might be, might be a chorus, I think. Obviously, I'm gonna put some melodies around it to, to complete it. But uh, yeah, this this is the second song I will be working on in the next videos. And uh, I don't know, maybe for the third video, I'm gonna get back to the first song, or maybe I'm gonna still keep working on this one. Let me know what you think in the comments below, and um, by the way, I still have more guitar playthroughs uh, in the works, on the way, whatever, and um, I'm pretty sure you, you might like it, so stay tuned for more, thanks for watching, I hope you liked it, I hope it was not too boring and too long and too sloppy, obviously that was sloppy, but 
just to give you ideas about how I work and how the songwriting process keep, keeps going. So I, I hope you liked it, I hope you enjoyed. I'm gonna do the YouTuber kind of speech, like thumbs up if you liked it, comment below, share with your friends, subscribe, all that stuff. See you in the next one. Take care. God bless. Peace out. I'm a man, 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 I'm a